Okay, guys and girls, as you get a little bit older, what is one sport that will help keep you in shape and let you get a whole lot older? Good morning, guys and girls. March 29, March 29. Golly, we just about used up the first quarter of this year. In television terms, we think of quarters, 13 weeks in a quarter. So, you know, just like this year, we're on uh, ESPN2, the first two quarters of the year, Discovery Channel, the first quarter of the year. So we've used up our, our allotment of time on the Discovery Channel this year. Most of the networks we're on, like WFN, World Fishing Network, the Pursuit Network, Heartland Television, all of those networks, we're on year-round. We're working with ESPN2, trying to get them to put us on the last 26 weeks of the year also. So if you have a hankering to send emails or, or, or comment to uh, those stations like ESPN, those networks like ESPN, tell them to keep Jimmy Houston outdoors on all year long. So we're on out there. Uh, anyway, okay, we're reading from our Catch a Better Life book that I took me about a year and a half to write. And we are uh, looking in the book of Joshua 1411. Joshua 1411. This is a verse that means a lot to me. As yet I am as strong this day as on the day that Moses sent, us, sent me. And he, the guy he was talking to that could be sent us also. Just as my strength was then, so now is my strength. Okay, I, you know, talked about, you know, a sport that would keep you young <laughs> and let you live longer keep you in better shape. Yeah, we'll talk about that in a minute in our tip. But this is Caleb speaking. He's speaking to his buddy Joshua. As yet I am as strong this day, today, as on the day that Moses sent me, just as my strength one was then, so now is my strength. Just as strong now as it was then. Okay, here's what I wrote about that. You young people might listen up to this too because one thing I found out about young people, if you live long enough, you'll be as old as me. You'll be as old as me. As I write this book, I am 76 years old. I am actually 77 now. So today's verse does mean a lot to me. I am still strong. And I may go back and fish some more tournaments. I sure might. Uh, I'm my buddy, Larry Walker, buddy of mine that I fish with, who is about my age, says he can do everything as well now as he could when he was 35 years old. That's what Larry's told me. Can I tell you, can I tell you, I really believe that I can too. I really believe that I can too. Do everything as well now as I could when I was 35 years old. Caleb, like we said that we're talking about in this scripture, was talking to his longtime buddy Joshua, who had become a leader, had become the leader of the children of Israel, the top guy. He's the guy that took Moses' place. Joshua actually parted the waters just like Moses did, a different river, a different river. Not only did he part the waters, it didn't stand up right there. He parted the waters, it stood up miles upstream, stopped flowing. Joshua's was, I'm telling you, Joshua's one that had a lot of faith, a lot of faith. He even asked the sun to stand still. Right in front of the people, he prayed to God for the sun to stand still. Surely I've written a devotion about that. But, and it did, and it did. Joshua, who had become a leader to the children of Israel. These two men, these two men together, had spied out the promised land, land years earlier and had encouraged the Israelites to go in and take ownership of it. You know the story, 12 spies, the other 10 spies said, oh, no, 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 we can't go in there. Those people are too big and strong. Joshua and Caleb was the only one to say, let's go fight them. Let's go get them. Let's go get them. That's our land. Let's go take it. Listen to me, though. Caleb was 85 years old on the day that he spoke the words that are in today's verse. And yet, as I am as strong this day as I was the day that Moses sent me to spy out the land. He was 85 years old. I'm 77. At 85, I'd just like to quote this verse right from the Bible, just as Caleb was talking to Joshua and said, as yet I am as strong this day as the day that Moses sent me. I want to be as strong when I'm 85 as I am right now. Can I tell you, if you've got a few years on you and you need a hero, may I suggest Caleb and Joshua. May I suggest that those two people be your heroes. Spies who gave a good report 
and they were given health well into old age by God himself, by God himself. If you honor God, if you put God first in your life, if you honor him in everything that you do, God will give you great health well into your old age, well into your old age. Our tip for the day, that sport we're looking for, yeah, fishing, you do that. Fishing is a sport. Keep fishing, guys and girls. Keep fishing long into your life. Walk as much as you can while you're fishing to keep your legs in shape. You keep your legs in shape. You know, I've got a wife right now who's trying to get her right leg to coordinate with her brain, but we are working with her every day to get that leg in shape, to get that leg strong. So when her brain tells that leg to take a step and walk, she's going to be strong enough to do it. If you can walk, if you can walk, do it. Don't be a come accounts to potato. Don't lay around. Now, I sit down a lot more in the boats when I'm fishing now than I did tournament fishing. I didn't even carry a front seat in my boat. I couldn't sit down if I wanted to. But I do sit down more fishing. You all have seen me do that. But you see me standing up the majority of the day also. Stand up when you fish. Walk as much as you can. Get out and fish some ponds and stuff. I fished off the bank here the other day and caught a bunch of them. A bunch of them fishing off the bank with a red man spinnerbait. Fish as long into your life as you can possibly get to your, the, the water and walk as much as you can. Honor God in everything you do. Put him first in your life. You're going to be like Caleb and Joshua. You're going to say, I can do everything as well now as I could when I was 35 years old. I'm just as strong. Guys and girls, have you a great day out there today. Go fishing. If you don't go fishing, walk. If you do go fishing, walk. And remember, sure do you